Hi, welcome there. Uh, Ojo here. I'm going to show you another uh, handcrafted uh, specialty drink. I can virtually make a latte using a simple uh, French press and aero press for my coffee. Um, heating some milk up on the stove and uh, my cute little IKEA serving dish. So you're going to see uh, exactly how we do this without an expensive uh, $3,000 espresso machine. So I'm just going to put a little bit of cold milk in the French press. I'm going to go just under halfway there. And uh, cold milk actually froths better than warm milk. So I do my frothing beforehand. And um, all I'm going to do is just make sure that I run air through that milk. And you see how quickly that's frothing. Now that I've got that done, I'll pull my lid off, put that to the side. I'm going to put this in just a little saucepan. You see how thick and creamy that is coming out. Now, I'm going to put this on the stove on a medium-high with the lid on, on a gas burner. By the time that uh, I'm done making the coffee, it'll be warmed up, ready to go. So. So now, I grind um, about 18 grams of fresh coffee. A little bit of hot water from my ginger water boiler. I'm also using a reusable filter, but uh, the AeroPress does come with uh, paper filters. press and it will only go about maybe halfway, maybe three quarters. Give it a stir. Put my uh, filter on. And my cap. Invert over top my cup. So this is uh, what I love about AeroPress. It gives you the extraction pressure of an espresso machine. Not quite, but more or less. The flavor of an espresso, the cleanliness of a drip, and the full body of a French press all into one little contraption. It's a really amazing dish. A contraption, sorry. Once you hear the air coming out of that, that is done. My milk will be done. Look at that. Handcrafted cappuccino or latte.